end of the day, man, like you have no obligation to do any of that stuff. So you can tell it's sincere, right? And if you were just going to the tip by chance, you would uh, you wouldn't you would open the door or whatever, but you wouldn't sit there and actually have the care to ask my name. You wouldn't care to make like you know ask about my profession. Mm -hmm. uh, you wouldn't care to make any kind of conversation, right? For sure. So, yeah. I mean, that's how just like I mean, to my experience with you in the past five, ten minutes, right? Mm. Or five minutes, right? That yeah. have given me the sincerity of uh, being customer centric rather than hoping for some kind of benefit in return. If that sums up what you asked. It does, it does. Something it made me think of is, it made me think of a couple more things. One, it made me think, Jet, about how. Uh, I've heard some drivers will say, hey, please give me a five-star rating because they really care about that, right? Yes. And so one of the things I've put on my on my platforms by way of my own perspective is if you have to ask for a review, you didn't do your job. That's right. Um, I think when you like serve that. someone well, you uh, don't have to worry about the outcome. Even if they don't give you a review, you've actually done what was necessary in the true sense of what was called for. And I really like that. Yeah. I really like that, actually. And so along those lines, if you're really confident in the quality you're putting forth, yeah. you don't have to look for commendation from anyone else. So it's great that I get reviews, but I never ask for a review. I've never asked for a review. I've got pretty stellar reviews. I've got pretty amazing uh, comments on my platform, but I never had to buy any of those. I like it when it's offered freely, spontaneously, and voluntarily. That's really important. Because then you know you're in your skill, yeah. doing really well, right? But when you have to say, hey, am I doing good enough? You're obviously not confident in your work you're doing in the first place. You know, man, I really like that. I, I really like that, actually. That's, mm -hmm. a, that's a fantastic elbow on it. There's a confidence that comes when you're able to say, bam, there's my job, and I'm so confident in it, I don't have to look back and see how it's being reviewed. Oh, you just keep on walking. 100%. Forward. You know, I'm someone who's do it once and yep. do it right. Absolutely. So, yeah. no, I, I, you know, like, um, I really like that, uh, yeah. that way of thinking, man. Yeah. It's, it's awesome. And, you know, uh, I'm telling you right now, most yeah. people, even just from the first two minutes of meeting you yeah. like, with the opening of the door, sure, why sure. Not, you would have a five star right there you know what I, mean? I have heard them say that but here's the, the thing I just did it just happened to me mm -hmm. so um, of course I keep track of my uh, my ratings but that's not a big indication for me because I never let that tell me how much I'm worth or not because that it's good when it's I'm doing great and it's also helpful until if I'm struggling to know how to probably fine-tune my craft but I never let my reviews dictate my worth and so why I say that is Recently, I just had a poor review come through. Yeah. Now, it's not because I treated anyone any less different. I love engaging everyone with the quality, with full-on enthusiasm, saying, glad you're here, I want to serve you as best as I can. But when I got this uh, poor review, it knocked down my perfect rating down a notch, right? Yeah. And for me, why I celebrated that is because I'm like, this reminds me I'm not perfect. This reminds me, secondly, that I'm not everyone's jam, and that's totally okay. Even though I am as courteous and upfront with everyone as I can, there are some people who are like, you're not my jam, and I want them to have full freedom to be able to, be able to say, I don't like what you're doing or, or your personality or whatever, because we're not supposed to all be the same. I'm not taking that personally, I'm just saying, I'd rather you have your full access to saying, I'd rather not spend time with you, but someone else. And I'm gonna reflect that in the way I'm gonna rate you. I don't take that personally because for me, my worth was never attached to my review. You, you see what I'm saying? No, 100%. And that, you know, man, what I like about that yeah. is a matter of, so there's two things. A, people, so this is just an example of, uh, yeah. you know, having the perfect rating. A lot of people are so up in their own head and egos nowadays, right? Like, it's like that one bad review will all of a sudden dictate you know, for you, it gave you a quick reminder, but a lot of people will sit yeah. there like, oh my God, I'm not perfect. I'm yeah. not what, what, yeah. what, yeah. what, yeah. right? Yeah. And uh, another reason why I really like that is, yeah. or uh, your view on that is because, you know, if a person doesn't accept defeat, and, or sorry, let me rephrase that. If a okay. person doesn't accept the educational side of defeat, mm -hmm. then they've just created a situation where they've been defeated with no benefit. Mm -hmm. So, by looking at a situation in which you had, you know, had failure, mm -hmm. well, 
why not go ahead and say, well, I, I don't know why I failed here mm -hmm. necessarily, but let's take a look at it mm -hmm. so I can be extra aware in that sense mm -hmm. and then it will not happen again. Right? Sure enough, yeah. So I think that, you know, like, you know, seeing that your score get bumped down and not giving a crap, right? That's yeah. that's awesome, man. Yeah. Like, that, that shows that you, even despite having a fantastic rating, and always are open to improvement. And that right. is massive. Right. Massive. I mean, if I was getting consistently poor reviews, I'd be needing to assess and say, okay, I need to think of something that I'm not seeing that many others are seeing, right? Exactly. So that's where the ratings are really helpful, I find. But even then, I'd tell that individual, by all means, take the intel you need to get better, but don't let that define your worth. Your worth is already there in the first place. And you just need to be able to see your worth aside from your accomplishments. 100%. So that's important, I'd say. Thank you got a great outlook, man. Here's Thanks, man. Yeah, I appreciate course. that. Yeah, of course, man. Jet, um, I'm going to ask permission uh, of you, yeah. and I'd love for you to have access to your no answer if that's what you feel. Yeah. I really value that. When I, po I On occasion, I'll post some of my conversations with my followers, yeah. just because I, I feel like the things that we talk about sometimes that come up in conversation yeah. would really serve some of, uh, of, of my audience who may struggle or need encouragement this way. Do I have, may I have your permission you to post? 100% have my permission okay. to do whatever you want without having anything in this video. I'll share with you my card so that you can also know where to find my stuff. Yeah, but I'll, I'll wait until you come back uh, from, from your appointment here. Yeah, yeah. And then I'll get you to fill out like a little consent form for me if you want, okay? Yeah, of course, man. That'd be amazing. Yeah, of course, man. And I appreciate you being willing to do that as well, too. I'm always happy to help. Always happy.